Hey everyone, welcome back to Carrots and Olives. My name is Brittany and today we are going to look into day 19 of 30 Days 30 Inks. But before we get started, let's look at day 18. This is a gorgeous ink. There is red sheen. That may be a little bit difficult to view in a fine nib pen and writing. But here is the card from yesterday. You can see that sheen. I have my my camera light on, so you could see that. Um, so it's kind of catching that sheen a lot better with the light on. It's a little dull outside right now because it's really early in the morning. Anyway, let's get started with day 19. I have <clears throat> my swatch card, the pen I'm using today, it's my Pro Gear Cyan color, which has a lot of meaning to me because when my second son was growing up, I mean, he's still young, but as he was learning his colors, he would always call blue cyan. And so when I discovered a Pro Gear uh, with the name cyan in it, I decided, oh, this would be perfect to, uh, to buy because it would always remind me of him. <laughs> so... Here are my selections. I just did a blue. I don't know if I want to do a blue again. Although there's a lot of blues here. Let's go with a, let's go with this color. This is different. Wearing gold myths from around the world collection. Zemina, Zemina. Let's see how this works. The swatch at the top is interesting. Maybe I should shake it. So there's glitter in here. I can tell that is true. And this is a 21 karat because it's a pro gear. So let's see. Just ink it up real quick. I have a feeling that this color is going to be very light. So, let's see. Okay, so it's a green, green color. Interesting, with a lot of glitter. It might look a little brown in the camera, but it's like a muted olive green. It might be a little dry since it's taken me many dips. So yeah, interesting. I'm gonna set that down to dry and we'll come back to that. Let's take a look at how the ink performs with water. So I'm getting my water brush. Not sure what's going on. I think I might need to floss it because the ink is hardly coming out. Okay, so I widen the tines a little bit. Wow, now it's super juicy. I hope I didn't widen the tines too much, but we'll see as we're writing. But yes, there needed to be an adjustment on the tines. Okay.
Wow, that makes a big difference. 30 inks, 30 days. A little bit hard to see with the glare. September 19th, 2023. Pen is the Pro Gear Slim. Oh, not a slim. Procure Cyan in a medium and the ink is Waringal Zemima Zemina Okay, and then what else? Let's check it on aerofoil paper. I think I might have a time that's misaligned. Pro Gear Cyan Medium. And this is Wearing Gold. Zemina. Okay, taking a look at how this ink performs. see that glitter all right so that's a medium nib in the sailor and it's writing a little bit thick only because I made an adjustment to the tines All right, so here is the swatch card. I don't know if you can see that sparkle, but it's actually really pretty against this. It almost looks like a stone color. <laughs> um, it's green, but also like gray, light brown, interesting color, and it has a sparkle to it. All right, so that is all I have for you today. If you have any questions, put them in the comments and I will talk to you in tomorrow's video. Bye.